Hi, Smokey. Hi, Smokey. Hi, Soot Kitty. Hi, Soot Kitty. Just the nicest barn cats you'll ever meet. Yes, we love you guys. You're beautiful. What's up, everybody? It's Lauren with Flip Flops Animal Sanctuary. And so our channel has kind of um, gotten a lot of attention over the last week or so. And we have expanded our YouTube family quite a bit. There's over 10,000 of y'all now that we're watching this. So thank you so much to everyone who has hit that subscribe button. Uh, that supports our animal sanctuary. We are a 501c3 nonprofit uh, organization for those that might be interested. And uh, we take care of over 70 animals here on the animal sanctuary, including geese and guinea fowl and emus. Um, and uh, we take care of a lot of roosters. Roosters are some of the most neglected and abused animals out there. Um, and we have about a dozen roosters here on the sanctuary that we care for. Um, but anyway, I just thought I would take y'all along with me today. I'm gonna go and feed the emus. So let's go, let's go see Sam and Corona because everybody really seems to love my giant dinosaur chicken. So let's go, let's go see them. All right, so the girls are right there. They're eagerly awaiting their breakfast, which is making me wonder if I brought enough food down for them. Usually, late I should say lately, they have not been super interested in eating a lot. Okay, who's starving? Who's starving, huh? Look at all that sass she's walking with. You see how sassy she's being with her head held back like that? Super sassy. Corona, I can't believe you got to put up with that. Look at how sassy she being. Sam, what's with the attitude, lady? What's with the attitude? Are you starving? You want to come get some snacks? Here. You want to see what's in the bucket? Who wants to see what's in the bucket? She's like, no, we want you to put that bucket in that bucket. Okay. All right. Hey, Rona. Hey, Rona. Hey, girl. How you doing? She does not like for me to mess with her. Hey, lady. It's okay. Hey, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. hey, hey. hey. Hey, hey, it's okay. Come here. Hey, she is this 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 bird. This bird is much more shy than Sam. It's okay. Hey, it's okay. Come here. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Isn't she beautiful? Hey, it's okay. She's nervous because Sam will pick on her because she gets jealous when I give her attention. So it makes her nervous. If I have the emus in separate fields, which I do from time to time, if they just need a break from each other, this bird here will just sit down at my feet and let me pet her. But when Sam is around, she gets very, very nervous. So, but that's okay. I will make sure Sam does not pick on you. Are you starving? Yes. Give me all of them snacks right there. <laughs> Sam, stay back. Okay, go on. Go on. All right. Let me make sure. I thought I saw something on my camera lens. Hey, Sam. Hey, Sam. Out and about today, lady. Look who I have. Look who I have. Oh. You got you got a neck full of food too. What are we gonna do with you girls? So this is Clucky Boy, and he is a shelter rooster. And uh, a lot of people think roosters are mean. Roosters are some of the most neglected, abused, and misunderstood farm animals there are. Every, for every chicken, for every hen that you get, let's say you have backyard chickens, for every hen that you get, there is a male rooster that was born. 
or hatched actually. And uh, generally what these hatcheries do is they take the male chicks and they do one of two things with them. Most of them either get ground up alive the day they're born, just right into an emacerator, or arguably worse is they just toss them in these giant, you know, industrial sized trash cans uh, and bag them up while they're still alive and they let them die by being crushed to death and suffocated. And that's what happens to 99.999% of male chickens that are born or hatched. I keep saying born, but it's actually hatched. Um, but Clucky is one of the lucky ones because despite making it through that nightmare and, and coming out into the world and still ending up at an animal shelter, Clucky gets to live out the rest of his life here on Sanctuary where we'll take care of him, we'll provide him food, shelter, enrichment, medical care as needed. But as you can see, he's right next to my face. He could peck my eyes out like everybody thinks a rooster would, but he doesn't because he's a very nice boy. And I don't actually, I don't handle Clucky very often. It's rare that I even pick him up. I let him do his thing because he's not especially fond of humans. Who knows what he went through the first part of his life? Probably some nightmare, but but as you can see, despite all of that and him being a little a little bit afraid of people, he's not mean to us and he doesn't he doesn't do anything to hurt us. And he's absolutely a wonderful rooster. He's not aggressive towards humans unless he perceives you as a threat. For example, if somebody new comes to the sanctuary, we will put Kalaki in a kennel because he is defensive of his family. And if he doesn't, if he recognizes them as a stranger, if he thinks they're a stranger, he will not be happy about them being here and he will go after them. But for like me, I can walk right next to Clucky and he, he is not aggressive towards me at all. I can pick up his ladies, I can pick up the other hens around him and he doesn't try to attack me. Um, but if a stranger came into the field, he would go after them. And so they're a lot like dogs in that way. They're very protective of their family, but they're just highly misunderstood. Um, but he is an absolute wonderful bird and uh, we will take really good care of him along with the other close to a dozen roosters that we care for here on our little sanctuary yes aren't you beautiful he's got a little bit of damage to his comb here he bonked his head on the side of his kennel door um, but these 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 parts this is called his comb and he has what is called a rose comb but they're very vascular and it takes next to nothing to make them bleed. Um, really not much anything at all to make them bleed, but it, uh, he has a very unique comb. Of all the roosters I have, I think he's got the coolest comb. And these, these things here are called waddles. These bits that hang under his chin is called his waddles, aren't they? Yes. Aren't you just the most beautiful guy? <laughs> all right, that's it for Clucky Cheese. Hey, Flip Flop. Hey, Flip Flop. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hi. Hi. How's my boy? How's, how's my boy? Flip Flop. Hi. Hi. Come here. You worried about that other ghost? Don't you worry about him. Don't you worry about him. Flip Flop. Flip Flop. Flip Flop. Flip Flop. Those other gooses are getting in the way. I know. You tell them. You tell them, Flip Flop. Yes, there's no boy. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Yes. you are the nicest guy. You are the nicest guy. Flip Flop. Flip Flop. Hi. 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 You are so beautiful. So beautiful you are. Yes. You are the most beautiful boy. Flip flop, flip flop, flip flop, flip flop, flip flop. Ah, you better be right. Look at all of that. Look at that. Did you see that? They came. They were sneaking up on me. Hi, flip flop. Hi, flip flop. Flip flop. What's going on? What's going on? Hi, flip flop. How are you? How are you? I love you. You're beautiful. 
You have a feather stuck on your beak. You have a feather right there. Can I get it? Give it to me. Can I have it? Good boy. We got it. We got it. How are you today? How are you doing, Flip Flop? You're just as beautiful as ever. You look at your neck feathers look really good today. Yes, they do. The neck feathers look really good today. You are such a handsome boy, you are. Yes, such a beautiful boy. Yes, sir. You are just the most handsome man. Yes. Yes. What's going on, baby? What's going on, big boy? You are such a big goose, yes. You are big goose. So beautiful. His neck feathers are the softest thing you'll ever feel. It's like running your hand through a cloud. So soft. Come here. Hmm? Oh, you waiting for me to put something in that bowl? <laughs> it's an empty food bowl. He's literally mimicking the sound, the, the, the action of eating. Come here, Flip Flop. Are you telling me? Hey, are you telling me you need your snacks? Huh? Huh? Come here. Flip Flop. Flip Flop. What's going on, baby? What's going on? Are you starving to death? Do I just never feed you enough? Huh? Do you need those snacks real bad? You're such a good boy. You're so beautiful. So beautiful. Yes, you are the most, don't, don't tell him that you ain't the most beautiful guy out here, yes. I love you. I love you so much. I love you so much, I do. I do. He's like, don't touch my neck. Don't touch my neck. You're so soft, Flip Flop. It feels so good. I cannot help it. I cannot help it. It is the softest. The softest thing. Yes. You are such a great big giant handsome boy. Hmm? Such a great big giant boy. Good boy. This, this is my boy. Yes. All right, I'll get your snacks. Let's get your snacks. This is the good stuff. Y'all want to see what I'm feeding them? This is a mix that I make up for them. It has uh, alfalfa grass, Timothy hay, orchard grass. It has fermented corn and grain. And the geese really like it. And uh, so I don't, I don't have any pasture for them to graze, unfortunately. So that's why I put the grass pellets in there. If you've got lots of pasture and they can graze all day, you don't really need it. But if it's winter time and you don't have anywhere for them to graze, I mix some grass pellets in there. I soak them. You got to soak them. Uh, and that gets them, you know, something closer to their natural diet. What do you think, Flip Flop? You like it? I was, I was showing everybody your food, but I guess it's your food, so. Hi, Henry. I don't know if y'all can, Henry's off camera. Hi, Henry. Come here, baby. Do you want some? Do you want to get some of this? Henry was my first goose that I ever had. And he held, holds a very special place in my heart. And he is such a sweet boy. This is, this is what it's all about. Buddy, that was mean. He's so rude. Come on. Yeah. 
Go on. No, you a bad. Come here. Want some more of this? Come on, Henry. You want some? My big boy. Flip up. Your booty's in the way. Your booty's in the way. Henry's a little more shy. Buddy Goose, and he's our resident troublemaker. He's always starting trouble. Or darn, aren't you, Buddy Goose? You know you've been had, don't you? Oh, don't bite his neck, you dinosaur. You and he getting jealous. Flip Flop's getting jealous. Okay, okay, I got rid of him. I know you was jealous. You were so jealous. Come here, give me a hug. Okay, that's it. All right, y'all. Everyone seems to really enjoy feeding the cats, so before I go in for the day. I thought I would take y'all with me while I feed the cats. Also, I have a tax bill I have to pay. It's a cat food tax bill. So I gotta go find the tax collector because I don't want any penalties or late fees or anything. Hey, are you starving? So kitty, are you starving? Hmm? Are you starving? We gotta go pay the cat food tax first. I gotta find her. Oh, there she is. There she is. Cat food tax. Here you go. This is my almost 12 year old turkey hen, Lurky Turkey. We really love her. We take real good care of this old lady. She has a heated coop at night. She's spoiled rotten. Okay, I think that's enough. I think you get an awful greedy tax collector. You gotta leave some for the cats. Hey, Barbie, you want some? You want to hit it? Here, you want to hit it? No, the turkey's going to take it all. Yes, Soot Kitty, come on. Oh, hi, Smokey. Hi, Soot, hi, Smokey. How are my babies? How are my babies? How are my babies? Okay, watch out. I gotta put it in there. Watch out. Okay, okay. What's more important, snacks or scratches? She's like both. They are both important. Oh, she's so warm. I just leave my hand on her. She's nice and warm. It's cold out today, but she soaks up all that heat. <laughs> okay. All right. There's feeding the cats. Well, look at these guys. So that's Elizabeth on the left there. She's the one that's super famous right now. FYI, her video has over a million and a half views on it. So she's super famous. And then that's her sister in the back there. That's Victoria right there in the back. She's also a very nice bird. This one here, that's Maverick. That's another female. And then right in the back, that's Gimp, another female. These are all ladies. There's India, hi India. Oh my goodness, lady. What's it like being one of the most beautiful ladies in the yard, huh? Look at how nice she is. She's such a sweet bird. You're so beautiful. Look at her beautiful paint on her head. That gray and brown. It's just, just an absolutely gorgeous bird. Y'all, I can't get enough of these geese. She got that mama pooch. Look, you see that mama pooch down there? That's that's to help her sit on all the eggs and keep the eggs warm. There's Clucky. Hey, Clucky. Clucky Cheese. Hi, Clucky Cheese. How you doing, my guy? You look good, buddy. Them feathers are looking good. Everybody's enjoying some chickweed that mom pulled from the garden for them. The chickens love it, the ducks get it, the geese will eat it. Oh, did you just chase that rooster away? That's Dick Duck, you see why we call her Dick? 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. 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 All right, look at y'all. Break it up. Oh, she won. She won, Clucky. You just got your butt whooped by an old Pekin. We have two males that have snuck over because I'm a moron and I left the gate open. Now, now I get to go and get them back. Let's go do that. All right, boys. You're not supposed to be over here. Now I have to catch catch you. Let's not make this let's not make this worse than it has to be. Let's not make it harder than it has to be. Henry. Henry. I hear you talking to me. Henry. Henry. You are so beautiful, Henry. You are the most beautiful man. Come on, let's go. Doro, don't you even try it. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Hi. Hi. Hi, Henry. This is my first goose ever. I love him so much. His name is Henry. He is one of my favorite people in the whole world. I love you, Henry. But you have to go back over with the boys. I do let Henry stay with the ladies sometimes, but he was just over here the other day. So he's got to go back with the boys. So let's go. Come on. Now, now I gotta catch flip flop. Flip flop, flip flop, come here, come here. Oh, I'm coming for you. Henry, don't you do it, go back. No. Sometimes, sometimes catching flip-flop is just as easy as scooping a goose. You just gotta scoop a goose. Just scoop them right up. Come on. Now, no, I ain't playing this game all day. Now I gotta go catch Henry again. <laughs> I got you. I caught you right on up. See, it's my boy. Oh, okay. I love that goose so much. I don't even care that I got to catch him a thousand times. Henry. Henry. Oh, I closed the gate. Now you want to go through it. This is my baby. Yes, I love you, Henry. I love you, Henry. I like the big old knob on his head. That looks so cool. Yes. Yes. I love you. I love you, I do. I do. I do. Get your beautiful boy. Yes, that beautiful boy. Isn't he gorgeous? I think I think of all the birds, <clears throat> the species-wise, geese, geese are my favorite. They're super cool. Like on an individual level, it's different, but geese overall are probably some of my favorite birds. Come on. Real quick before they try to sneak back, I gotta give them their ferment, which is just the rinse or the, the water that we pour 
off of their corn ferment and it's I mean the geese like a really wet soupy food so it makes them happy but it's full of probiotics so it's really good for them so don't even try it don't even try it please thank you so anyway All right, and the rest of that is for the ladies over on the girl's side. Holiday, what's going on? Are you just as handsome as they get? Yes, you are as handsome as they get. He's like, I'm gonna try to kill that bucket. Oh, I'm trying to kill the bucket, y'all. We're gonna hook. We're gonna hook this uh, this fence this time. Hey, turkey ducky. That makes everybody happy. All right, well, I guess this is it for today's sanctuary shenanigans. I don't even know what to call this. This wasn't supposed to be a vlog. I think what I'm gonna do is just edit all these clips together into one really long video. So if y'all like, look at me, I'm a mess. Like my ponytail's all off to the side. I'm tired. I think I'm gonna edit these videos into just like one long sanctuary day in the life of vlog um so but thank you to everyone new who's joined our channel we really appreciate it and we've had a ton of people send us stuff off our wish list like that's that's gotten really crazy lately and we really appreciate it because those are all things that we've kind of been dealing without for a long time which makes life difficult here but you know like medical supplies and someone sent us some uh, grubs i think it was anna that sent the grubs and then uh Someone sent Cody a new swing. Check out that video. I'm going to put that. I think that video is on my channel already. Maybe not. I don't know. But look for that video uh, where Cody gets to see her new rope toy. It's, like, it's just like a 50 foot rope, but it's like a big deal because it's like one of Cody's favorite things that she's been doing without that for a while. So, but anyway, thank you to everyone who sent us stuff off of our wish list. Everyone who has sent us donations. We've received a handful of donations lately, which come in real handy because we were short on our our feed run funds. We didn't have enough money to go buy feed for everyone. And we were able to do that the other day, thanks to those donations. So we really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and I hope everybody has a great day.